than 500 years, ink printed on paper has been the best medium for delivering written information. But as the world becomes increasingly digital, all that is changing. Here at the Knight Ritter Information Design Lab in Boulder, Colorado, a team of journalists, designers, technologists, and researchers is putting together the tools that will take today's newspaper into the electronic age. We will have the interactive graphic now. So when you click on the graphic, it will animate on the front page. But you click on the story. Roger Fiddler established the lab for Knight Ritter in the fall of 1992. Today, he serves as its director. Well, I do believe that for the first time, we're going to begin seeing an alternative to ink on paper. Uh, it may be difficult to conceptualize the idea of digital paper, but in fact, we believe that's what's going to happen. IDL is a, a media think tank. Uh, we bring people to the lab to uh, give us more insights into the developments of technologies, or particularly digital technologies and digital communication. Uh, our role is to investigate the opportunities that may be there for newspaper companies over the next few years and to also try to develop a long-range vision of where the newspaper industry is headed over the next 5, 10, 20 years. An important part of this evolution is the emergence of the electronic tablet. This device is under development at consumer electronics companies around the world. Tablets will be a whole new class of computer. They'll weigh under two pounds. They'll be totally portable. They'll have a clarity of screen display comparable to ink on paper. They'll be able to blend text, video, audio, and graphics together. And they'll be part of our daily lives around the turn of the century. We may still use computers to create information, but we'll use the tablet to interact with information, reading, watching, listening.